Shalom. I'm Rabbi Denise Egger, the rabbi of Congregation Kolami in West Hollywood, California, and I'm also president of the Southern California Board of Rabbis, and I'm here to tell you that it gets better. There are a lot of voices out there right now bringing this same message, and if you are a lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, or questioning teenager, I hope you're hearing this. You are not alone. There's a community that wants to support you in tough times and celebrate with you in the good times, no matter how alone you might feel. As a rabbi, I want you to know that anybody who tells you that God condemns you is just plain wrong. God loves you just the way you are. And if anybody says to you, but the Bible says, I want you to remember this. God gave us the Bible as a tool for us to live our lives, not as a weapon to beat up other people. And history is full of people who are wrong about what the Bible says, using it to support slavery, to oppress women, to condemn Galileo for discovering that the earth revolved around the sun instead of the other way around. And it turns out that the same people who were wrong about what the Bible said about slavery, about women's equality, and about astronomy, are wrong about what the Bible says about homosexuality. The Torah teaches us that all people were created in God's image. In Hebrew we say, B'Tselem Elohim. That means you were created in God's image just as you are. We also learn from Scripture, love your neighbor as yourself. No one who is living a holy life or a godly life and does violence, taunting, teasing, or bullying is really religious. You are loved by God and the Jewish people. You are created in God's image exactly as God intended you to be. God doesn't just want your life to get better. God wants your life to get fabulous. And I didn't always know that. Growing up, trying to figure out who I was supposed to be and what I was supposed to do wasn't always easy. And I didn't always get it right. But it got better. I grew up in the Deep South, where being a lesbian and being Jewish wasn't a cool thing. I was taunted and teased. But I hung in there. And I lived out my dreams to become a rabbi, one of the first openly gay or lesbian rabbis. It did get better for me, and I promise it will get better for you. If you need help believing that it will get better for you, reach out to the Trevor Project, to my synagogue, Congregation Kola Me in West Hollywood, California, to the Union for Reform Judaism, or the North American Federation of Temple Youth. There are people ready to help you and help keep you safe. And remember, God loves you beyond your wildest imaginings and wants you to be exactly who God created you to be. Believe that promise. We are here for you. And grow up to be the best you you can be. It does get better. God bless. Shalom. Peace.